Sheriff Warden. I will tell you a story. Once upon a time, there were three queens. They lived in a flying castle and sailed across the sea of stars to find new lands to rule. One day, their castle fell from the sky into the land of ice. The first queen fell asleep. The second toppled from her throne. The third escaped, but lost her way on the farthest moon. The three queens slept for many ages. Until a great sorcerer found the first queen. He gave her food and drink, and soon she woke. She called out to her sisters, but they could not hear. She tried to wake them, but was too weak. So she taught the sorcerer how to build the magic door. The sorcerer's apprentice, a trickster and rogue, found the second queen. She locked her away aboard a ship sailing off to an evil land, where the sorcerer's enemies schemed against him. But this second queen, she too was given food and drink as she woke as the ship sailed on. She was a clever queen, and soon learned the language of her captors. She made the captain and crew forget. They could not remember where they had come from, where they were going. And so they sailed back to the land of ice. She struck their out of the ship, and confused their words so they would not be known. She was also an angry queen, unhappy to be held prisoner in this manner. And she vowed to destroy all the people in all the cities in her path, so they could do no harm to her or her sisters ever again. She told the slaves to rise up and kill their masters. And so they did. The sorcerer finished the magic door and entered with the first queen. Now she was home, and a great feast was laid out before her. She ate and drank and grew stronger, until at last she could speak to her sisters, marooned across the sea. And this is how the third queen woke, lost on the farthest moon. The three sisters were together once again, though far apart. And they were pleased with these new lands. Far off places with strange names. The people there would join the others, the trillions upon trillions. Conquered, annexed, devoured. As the magic door opened on the farthest moon, their armies charged across the frontier, hungry for glory. This is how it ends. Where are you going?
you are so far from home, are you afraid? Come find us. We can help you. You're getting closer. Warden, your story ends here. You can join us or die. There is no other choice. We have consumed entire civilizations. Yours is no different. Why do you believe in survival? Is it hope? Delusion? We are not machines. We abide in the architecture around you. We inhabit structures greater than the stars themselves. You are small, too ignorant to comprehend. The portal to Ymir is open. The assimilation has begun. You are too late. We have already won. You are but a single consciousness. We are trillions. This machine is mere form, a hollow vessel. We cannot be destroyed. destroyed.